Hey everybody, this is not a spring chicken. Who says that the Supreme Court does not play football? What? Yes, the Supreme Court punted when it came to affirmative action earlier this morning. Now we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. <laughs> it's, where, it's like a big kid. He found another stuffed animal. Do I take news seriously? <laughs> that was a tech bear. That actually was from a tech show. Yep. Yep. And it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, God, yeah. They found out today that the Democrats are telling the Republicans what they've got to do. Uh, all the Republicans that are supporting Obama's immigration proposal have been told when they go home for the, you know, uh, for the summer that they are to go, they are not to go home for the summer because if they go home for the summer, they'll end up talking to constituents. If they talk to constituents, immigration reform is totally dead because the Republicans have got this weird idea. Uh, you're never going to do securing the border if you give the 11 million people. Well, we're not giving them, you know, amnesty. Well, you're giving them amnesty. You've got to let them all have their cards first. Then you're going to do this. The next step will never come. It didn't, it hasn't came yet. They, they basically set aside like $20 billion to seal the border up. And as soon as Obama became president, they stopped it. Mm -hmm. Oh, should we tell them? Yes, they can become citizens and pay taxes. Yeah, and we're, we're not just talking about sales taxes, oh, income tax. Oh, no, but they're already, they already are saying that they're all, they're, that here's the thing is that if you were a smart Republican, you say, well, according to what you've been saying for years now, they pay their fair share of taxes already. So the income tax thing goes up. And the President of the United States said this morning, he just got through doing a speech of how positive the economic impact is going to be, okay, oh, the little bear... For, forget how many people don't pay income yeah, tax. Yeah, but bear is going to say something to the, all the Republicans and people out there. What are you going to say? Oh, they're already here. They're already working. They aren't going to improve their economic position in the next decade. They're already here. If they're already here and they're making $10 now, they will only be making ten dollars tomorrow until the, all of them are put on a system, and they said it's going to deflate people's salaries and reduce and less money per hour being paid. So they will have a negative effect if they leave everything alone. They'll continue to pay exactly what they're doing now, which is more than they will be paying when they get become citizens. Isn't that brilliant? <laughs> He's a really smart bear, folks. I had to bring him out more, but I found him this morning. He was waiting for me. And the U.S. says it will buy Russian helicopters for the Afghan military. Okay, <laughs> here comes Bear again. Bear's going to say something. Don't you know? Don't watch the lips of the person up above. Oh, actually, this is how it goes. We make helicopters in the United States. We do not need to buy Russian attack helicopters. We make helicopters in our country. Why are we buying Russian helicopters? Because he's trying to make them. up with Putin, who doesn't give a rat's ass about him. Well, Putin doesn't give a rat's ass about him because, wait, did you hear what Putin said about him? Oh, God, yeah, he doesn't think he It's not going to make it up to okay, them. Okay, okay. Nothing that they say in Europe about this president and his, and his failures is ever making it to the shores of the United States. Unless you have cable or satellite, then everybody knows what they're saying because you have Spanish language station, you have French, you have Russian, you have German, you have Chinese, Japanese. And you mean those people can actually get the information we're censoring? Yes. They're not very bright. So. And the U.S. warns countries against note and travel. Oh, but again, back to Bear. Remember, Bear says they don't give a damn. I know. Oh, and Snowden's travel coincided with what? Hey. Go Daddy being hacked. Go oh, Daddy being hacked. Isn't that amazing? We, we once again, we've really tanked. We're, 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 we're actually, we've got like seven sites, eight, nine sites all done with Go Daddy, and when their servers went down, we went down for the day with them, folks. We went out for the count again. An explosion in Kabul, New York, Afghan National Parliament. Yeah, but basically, Afghanistan is going to turn into a god awful, unbelievably bad place to be when Obama pulls the troops out. I'm going to explain something. I used to do westerns. My father did westerns before I did. 
My father used to play lots of cavalry officers. I played the Indians chasing cavalry, of course. My father played cavalry. You keep the cavalry there in outposts so if they're needed, they can get from one place to another. Here's a, you know, I, I'm from the Vietnam War area, folks. We had a thing called a Mike Squad, which basically were people that were used to fill the holes. In the, if you ever go watch Zulu, you'll see that uh, Stanley Baker kept Michael Caine in the background with a squad of his best to go in and fill holes, which is what kept the Zulu from overrunning the compound. It's called, it's been done for like a zillion years. The British created it. And North Korea says, Sur surveillance leaks prove U.S. is kingpin of rights violators. Yeah, like he, they blew the whistle on Obama, and <laughs> you see the President of the United States wearing shirt sleeves at the G8 because they didn't trust the man to be seen. They wouldn't know what in the hell could he be bringing in with him. Mm. Third point, out Sony stake and calls for independent entertainment board. Well, uh, what's going to happen, they're splitting Sony up uh, because the electronics division is basically suffering because they, well, if you make bad product over in the entertainment side, okay, video games have tanked this last couple of years. There's the flat screen TVs. Here's how it works. You had, every, every family had five or six color TVs, including big ones, in their homes when they didn't go to HD. When the United States government forced everyone to go to HD, it went to one television in a house. Guess how many new TV sets are not being sold to homes today, and guess how much more expensive those are that they are selling them. Mm -hmm. And Sprint Sue's Dish and Clearwire's key deadline loans. Uh, the problem is, is that they, uh, that the stockholders are going to make billions, as much as ten billion dollars less, to uh, than they were under um, Dish offering to buy the system. And you know there's going to be suits over that. I mean, if I was going to, if I was a major stockholder and I was going to make a billion dollars profit because of DISH and now I'm going to lose money, mm -hmm. I would not be happy. So don't look for that. That's got to be in the courts for a long time. And batteries hold key to wearable device revolution. Batteries are, bad. nobody makes a decent battery, so we know that. Although I do have a decent battery in my Samsung Note. <laughs> yeah, but they, they, you know, but we have to have more than one note to see. I know, and Apple upgrades not sexy, but awesome. Not from what I've been hearing, they uh, from what I've been hearing from the people said it's a god awful disaster. They said that the, if this is the best they can do, this why Apple continue to lose market share. They they lost market. Okay, the smart the uh, Android outsells the Apple, uh, uh, continually outsells them. And U.S. security experts say surveillance cameras can be hacked. Yeah, uh, mm -hmm. they do it all the time. It doesn't take a genius. Like a little kid can do it with a with a. Okay, we're talking. The you have computers that have enough RAM in them to, li to land an airplane at at LAX, and you can walk around with it. I mean, the thing that that she's holding behind the camera over there talking to me is it, it's a, it's like ten inches in size and and is a full blown. 3D computer, folks. And Wiener defends his reaction to voter who used gay slur. Uh, that's not a smart thing to do because you're never going to get elected to to um, to office by mouthing off at somebody you don't like. Mm -hmm. And Obama to lay out climate change plan and speech on Tuesday. Oh, okay. this is Bear the Mark. Bear says, "Oh, the president's going to screw everybody in the country. You're going to end up paying a buck a gallon in new taxes." You're going to end up coal plants are all going to be shut down. Nuclear plants are going to be shut down. And he's not going to allow any more drilling of anything in our country. I know. And I'm sitting there looking at gas is what, $4 and what, 29 cents a gallon it, they, for the cheap gas at the low pump prices. They're going to add it. Obama wants a gallon added to every tax, every gallon, a, t a dollar added to every gallon in order to force people to go green. And time's up. Immigration won't pass this year. Uh, because if they go home, it's done, and it's gonna, they're going to have to go home. And you cannot run and hide from your constituency because what happens is, while they're running and hiding from their constituency, they're getting recall petitions signed. And NSA leaker Snowden's passport revoked. Oh, my gosh. It means he can't go to countries that basically kiss our butts. I don't think he was going there anyway. No, but Obama <laughs> doesn't know it. <laughs> the Democrats and the Democrats and the Republicans aside with them on Snowden don't understand the same one. Oh, uh, I have this gun. 
You mean I, I was supposed to have bought my gun legally in a gun shop and be turned down when I can go over here to the guy with the automobile on the street and buy my gun? I don't know. The president and his people don't understand that you don't buy guns legally if you're a bad guy? <laughs> and a Monty bubbleism for the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Uh, okay, change, change is hard to come by.